and you are your support means so much. like i've been scared to admit this i've been scared of you know like announcing this um well you can hear me talk like on this call I I feel like I'm generally like at least a little bit funny. Like enough for a Twitch stream maybe. Um because you haven't gotten off your ass and done it. Yes. Yeah, that's what she said. Yeah. Mm, that's different. Buying it. Buying a hat. What? No. Ooh, this is a cool suit. No, it's not like that. Good monthly, I like that guy. Dude, that guy, that guy's so annoying. I forgot what it was, but I played a Pokemon and that, I really hated him on top. I hate that guy, he's so annoying. Because he like hits you hard and he takes a bunch of damage. Oh, I'm such a badass. Andres. Um, no. Nelson has a favorite to ask you once he's done taking a shit. He wants you to do his chemistry. Yeah, you guys have chemistry. If he's unhappy with you, I'll get the blame. I could get fired. Is that what you want? I don't want to do chemistry. That's not what he means. He says he doesn't want to do chemistry either. Ask him what type of chemistry is. What type of chemistry is it? Bitch. Break our mother's heart. Now get into gear and help out with lunch or we'll both be in trouble. Okay. Empirical formula is answered. Right. No, I'm not. I'm oh, definitely going to do the empirical formula. That's mystery. Do you hear him? Ah! Hello, I'm sorry, but like... Could I interest you in some there's no way I'm doing empirical formulas. Yikes. Hey, you! Why'd you do that? Oopsie daisy. I finally punched the belly guy. Welcome to Sapienza 47. Silvio. Um, where was that guy? Okay, so I'm gonna take a different approach. This time I'm gonna... Oh, okay, never mind. How do I get up there? Oh! No, never mind. Why aren't you wearing any pants? Never mind. Get down here. Oh, I can come through here. Okay. I'm going to ring the door. I might 
Sakshi? Okay, you're there. Okay, I, I wasn't getting any feedback, so I wasn't sure if you guys could like. Let me guess, yeah. conservatives? Hey, sorry, pal. I voted. Uh, excuse me, but it. Oh. Someone, please help me! What are you talking about? Nobody heard that. Uh, me punching this dude. Oh, I don't have anywhere to, like, store this guy's body. Hey, do you have a bathroom? Okay, let's just take this kitchen assistance disguise. This guy's broke as fuck. He doesn't have a bathroom. Oh, a key card. What the fuck? It was like 8 p.m. like literally two minutes ago. Yep, I remember that. It's good times before I was getting constantly verbally abused. Yeah, they do say that, but I mean, this. They didn't say that when I wasn't in this call, so, you know. Uh, more or less what I'm doing here, except I wasn't getting verbally abused. It was, it was all right. You guys ever been in one of those situations where you like, where you like, um, you know, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta take off the bag off, off the machine, but if you take the bag off the machine, then all that stuff inside the bag like spills out, so you don't even know what to do. Okay, so you are inserting a bag full of something into a machine, but it's like too full of an espresso machine. Okay, it's an espresso machine and a bag of coffee beans. Since I guess I have to be so hyper specific for you people. Um, and so what ha- Okay. And so what happens is, you know, you, you gotta take the bag of beans off the machine. But if you take the bag of beans off, all the beans that are left over in the bag, you're gonna spill. Because you cut the bag wrong, so you can't really pour it in, so you're just gonna put it on top of the machine. And then, and then you don't know what to do, and then you take off the bean bag, and all the beans spill everywhere. And you're like, ah, shit. And then your shift lead has to, like get, get like, just to get a, a vacuum, a vacuum up all the coffee beans, and you're like, whoops, relatable. Man, why, why am I in this call, huh? Why, why am I in this call, you guys, you guys, you guys, You're not sorry. You just you. Ooh, a chairlift. If I was like disabled, I would probably use one of these all the time. 
on trespass. Yeah, like up. Uh, exactly what's That's the song that all the people on TikTok use. And they're talking. They're like a day a day as a person with <gasps> cannabis joint? Oh, yeah, so actually I was thinking about you earlier. Cause I was, cause, cause my mom and I were talking about smoke shops and how they're like, and they're like, they're always not very, they're not, they're not often very classy, right? Like a lot of them have like a bunch of neon signs and they're like smoke, like, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like, oh yeah, the one stock she goes to is quite classy. Um. <laughs> no, I didn't. No, no, I did not tell her that. Like, I should have though. We've been talking about uh, we've been talking about drugs lately. How stressed have you been? Yeah, I'm Uh, yeah. Uh, you you're just like you're the face of like cannabis usage. Honestly. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I have an idea. Oh, put the gun away. Okay. So you see this guy over here? Yes, we see the guy. Well, so he goes near this, this lawn mower. And I can create an oil leak right here with my wrench. And, and with the oil leak, oh, 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 we're going up. What that means is that I, when he passes by again here, and he like, he like walks by the lawn mower. Oh, did I get? Recorded, I sure did. He passes by the lawnmower. I can shoot it with my gun and then it'll explode and it'll kill my target. So smart. This is the way from the pass by. So. Sachi is huge. Guys, he's got any takes? Mm, just in general, I wanna do the takes. Dude, James Garfield was dripped out of his mind. Look at this guy. It's, it's badass. Oh no, he wasn't close. Oh, okay. 
Okay, let's try that again. You know, I really wonder what it was like before I was here. Were, th were things like sad and silent? Oh, uh, so then what the fuck? You know, why are you guys being sad and silent to me? Huh? Okay. Okay. And. Uh, yeah, that's right. I can't even talk about the Atlanta Braves, like, lineup. You know what? You know what? They, you know? You know who's responsible for this? Joe Biden. This is his America. Not kinda. Totally true. Oh. Uh, bro, he doesn't even walk near the lawn. It's okay. I'm gonna hit him with a good old headshot. Standing perfectly still. <laughs> Ow, 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 ow. Okay. You shoot one guy and everyone shoots at you. Whatever happened to the Gandhi, huh? Well, when he said eye for an eye, whole world goes blind. What does that not apply when you shoot people? Welcome to Sapienza, Why can't they just turn the other cheek? It's fucked up. You know where I would have loved to live? Dr. Lafayette speaking. Just so, I'm outside Villa Caruso now, enjoying a coffee in the sun. Lovely town. So, anything I should know about Dr. Caruso before our first session? I was briefed on his anxiety attacks. I mean, you're supposed to ask, oh, where? Mm, very well. Don't you worry. Caruso is not the first troubled genius I have turned around. Just look at Jordan Cross. I'll have young Silvio calm and serene in no time. Okay. And you as well. Where I would have loved to live is Babylon. It seems Ether Management is concerned about Silvio Caruso's mental no. health. No doubt like, due the to his actual... mental breakdown last year. They the have actual, hired well-renowned like, psychologist, Dr. Oscar Lafayette, to treat the neurotic bioengineer. The session will no doubt take place in private. I want to live in Babylon. Our records Ancient capital Babylonia. Previously met. I think... <laughs> yeah, probably. I think, I think it was banging there, because I remember in the Bible, they were like, oh yeah, that place sucked so bad, so we destroyed it. And then, like, uh, and then it was good. And they almost had that tower. Come on. Apparently the kings of Babylon were linked 
with Lucifer. What's up with that? Yeah. It owe me this. If <laughs> if God was so all powerful and what not, how come he let uh sins be around? Checkmate Christians. So actually here's a fun riddle for you. Okay. You're never gonna get this one. What's red and smells like blue paint? You searched it up. You searched it up. I am heavy. Backwards, I am not. What am I? Shut up. That's the wrong answer. No. Because you're wrong. Okay, well, your, mis your mistake was a fatal. Have you gotten the riddle yet, Sakshi? It's, it's ton. No, it's not. How's that cheating? How is that cheating? Um. What tastes better than it smells? Your tongue! <laughs> and then the riddle cuts off Batman's tongue. What building? What building can't clap? What building can't clap? <laughs> this one is... Yeah. You got it. You got it. Good job. Nelson, you're the best person at riddles. Yeah. You're the best. Way better than anyone else. <laughs> okay, here's another one. Which month has 28 Dang. Whoa, you got it, Nelson. Okay. Take one out and scratch my head. Yet there are only three people in the car. How? Oh. 
take one out and scratch my head. Yet there are only three people in the car. Take out your liver, Batman! And then he pulls out the livers. If two's company and three's a crowd, what are four and five? Nine. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get this one. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> um Take one out and scratch my head. No, just just What was once red or take one out and shut up, shut up. Take one out and scratch my head. What was once red is now black. What am I? I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. What are you talking about? God damn, you crazy. Oh. Who saw that? Nobody did anything to you, woman. Okay. Two fathers and two sons are in a car, yet there are only three people in the car. How? How is that possible? There are two... There are two fathers... There are... There are two, oh, shut up. Yeah. Yo, mama. What's the difference between a chalupa and a chupacabra? Ooh, close, but no cigar. 